Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to TCG Treasures, my name is Maddie, and today we're going to be unboxing Icons of the Realm D&D Monsters Menagerie 2 pre-painted plastic figures. Alright, so let's get started. First, a little backstory though. This was coming in a package that I ordered from Amazon. They also had the Christmas gift from my mother, and never got delivered. Well, at least it didn't get delivered on time. Because the mail ran here about 2 o'clock and this wasn't delivered and it was supposed to be delivered by USPS. And then just randomly showed up at my house about 30 minutes ago. It's like 8 o'clock now. So, that's cool. So here's the hope and we get something good after all that waiting for it. So, I'm worrying about where it was. Huh, huh, huh. Honestly, the only thing I really actually want out of this set is a beholder. And this box does not have the beholder because it's way too light. Ah, that's no good. Ah, we got a black pudding. Which, a lot like the... Ooh, a bugbear! Nice! Bugbear, bugbear, whatever. Since we're going to be unboxing about a lot of them, I'm not going to focus on them. But you can put a little miniature in there, like he's getting consumed by the black pudding. So, yesterday, I was supposed to tell you guys some things, and I did not, so I'll try to do it in this video. Nice. Sea hag, right? Yeah, sea hag. So, my friend Jamie is setting up on his computer, because he's smart and I'm not, a way for me to stream MTGO videos. Nice. Is that a goblin? Yeah. Hmm. Nice. So that was our first box. Nothing too exciting there. But he's setting up on his computer a way for me to um, stream the MTGO playthroughs. So that's going to be pretty cool, and that's going to be coming to the channel. And I don't understand computer stuff, so he's doing it for me. So that's very nice of him. Because I'm not good at computer stuff at all. Okay, so this looks like a warg. A warg, warg, warg. Warg. Nice. Not disappointed in that. Like I said, the only thing I care about getting is a beholder, so, you know. Probably not going to get one either. Ooh, this is a rare, I believe. A gold dragonling. Oh, no, this is a brass. Hmm. Oh well, I think it's still maybe a rare, I don't know. I don't know the rares and uncommons in this set. Oh, here's a monk, looks like. And a human monk, I would be right. Oh, this is a little teeny tiny, Ah, oh, it's an invisible one. Ah, oh, sucks. So this is a halfling rogue, an invisible one. It sucks. The only reason I buy these is to get pre-painted figures, not invisible figures. I want them pre-painted because I cannot paint. Although, fortunately for me, my girlfriend can. But it's a hassle for her to have to paint them, so I don't like to have a bunch for her to paint. Although she's very good at it. Here's the cathedral she painted for me. Very nice exactly the way I wanted it with the brown roof and like the gray like bricks and stuff very nice she does a really good job ah we've got a golem she also painted some other stuff but it's in the box right now and that was just right there so I was able to just show you that nice this is an iron golem yeah okay pretty cool here we go we got a an orc! Nice. You can never have too many orcs. And now I have two. <laughs> I love unboxing this. It's so much fun. Oh, cool. What is... Oh, man. A, a Shahan again? So, sorry, I probably butchered that. But it looks cool. Very nice. And what's our last one? It's a little itty bitty one. Ah, cobalt! I love cobalts. Yeah, cobalts. 
I got a weaned cobalt. Y'all watch me open that. All right, so we're about to do our fourth one in no beholder, and this is not a beholder because it feels too light. So it's not good. We might have to do another one. See, there's certain creatures that I really like. They're from a book that I read as a kid, and I keep promising that I'll show you all that book. I think I said it in the last video that I would, but I never do because I'm that type of person. I will remember one day and show you. So this is a... a I don't know what this is, actually. I wanted to say a griff. Oh, a hippogriff. Okay. Yeah, I didn't watch much Harry Potter. I was always more of a Lord of the Rings fan. I love Lord of the Rings so much. Um, get it on the stand real quick. Sorry, folks. It's not working. It comes with a stand. And these videos already get long enough without me. Take it. Ooh! Yes! A bullywug. That's what one of my betas is named after, a bullywug. I like frogs a lot. I think he's asleep right now. Let's see. A Calabdur. Pretty cool little rock enemy. Not bad. I like it. No duplicates so far. Very cool. Although I wouldn't mind getting duplicates of the road. Ooh. What is this? A Hobgoblin. Nice. That is another one that I was wanting. See, I forgot. I looked up a long time ago, but I never actually ordered this. And it had some ones that I wanted. This one's decently heavy-ish. Maybe. Maybe. No. I think we got a Chimera. No. Oh, it's a Sphinx. Yeah. That was one that I did not want to get. Is, it, is the Chimera even in this set? That's the real question. Probably not. We got a Andro Sphinx. Um, believe it or not, I was never really into Egyptian mythology, so Sphinxes don't really, you know. Sorry. Oh, we got another one of those, but I think this one's a little bit... No, it's the same thing. Okay. So, we got another one of the ones that I can't pronounce. Sorry, folks. Which is not bad. Aha! Another orc. This is a different orc. No, it's the same orc. Okay. I'm not good at telling the differences. I thought the last one had a shield. So, like I said, you can never have too many orcs. I am not disappointed at that at all. Looks like we got an NPC. Oh, man. That is nice looking. I like that. What is this supposed to be? A human cleric. Oh. So it can be a PC or an NPC. Nice. Oh, this one also comes with a stand, but I have really hard time setting up the stand, so just trying to move it on. Not heavy enough to be a beholder. This is not good. I don't think I'm getting a beholder, which is, like, really hard to get. Might as well just probably buy one. I'm terrible at that. Like, I will always not buy something. I'd rather just open up tons and tons of packs and spend opening tons of packs than just spend like a little bit extra to buy the thing I actually want. I do that with cards too. Clay Golem, pretty cool. Which if you watch my Ultimate Masters unboxing, which I'm supposed to put up probably today. Here's another Cobalt. I think this is the same Cobalt. Yeah, same Cobalt. But I like Cobalts. So... I think I'll put it up today. Yeah, I did horrible on that. Really horrible. Not as bad as it could have been, though. But I was visibly disappointed in it. Even said some profanities that I was not supposed to. There's a giant rat. That's pretty cool. Oh, wow. I really like the look of that. That's another bugbear, but this is different from the last one I got. This one looks kind of like an executioner. Man, that is nice. Um, this is the last one I got. But man, this one looks a lot better. I like it. Fall to your doom. All right, two boxes left. 
Alright, let's open the banged up one first. This one was banged up. This one has my beholder in it. And it got broken because it's banged and damaged. I wonder if WizKids does anything to fix that. I think these are coming up for WizKids. Does not have the beholder. Has another golf. Didn't really want this many golems. Didn't really want any golems. But I, I keep saying golem because I am a big Lord of the Ring, Rings fan, so sorry about that, folks. So that's a golem. Golem. And this is a half orc barbarian. So this is something that really actually disappoints me. A lot of these characters, like the the uh, PC characters that they make are, are female and yeah, it kind of sucks. We should make some male characters. Not all guys want to roleplay as a girl. Oh, is that another orc? Yeah, it's another orc, but this one's definitely different. Yeah, this one's way different. I like this one. This one's got a sledgehammer. Warhammer. Yeah, it's definitely a lot different than the other one. That's the other one we got. Not bad. Now I got some. I got four orcs now. We're in there now. Alrighty, what else is there to get out of here? Because we definitely did not get a beholder. So, oh, excuse me, folks. Last box or one of these boxes? I didn't open one of the figures out of there. Oh, that looks really cool. Some kind of devil-looking creature. Tefling warlock. Yet again, another female character, which is annoying. Where's some male player characters for us to play with, you know? Oh, this looks like something cool. I mean, oh wow, that is cool. I like that. This is a knoll. Oh man. Wow. Wow, I really like that a lot, actually. So, what's in this one? Another orc. Okay. Plenty of orcs. I'll do the big one last. It's nothing good. And a female halfling rogue. Again. Make some male characters for the other people, you know? Hate to say it, but there's not probably a lot of females playing this game, so make some male characters, please. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe there's a lot of females playing this game. Maybe that's why. Clay Golem. So, all in all, pretty cool. There they all are. Not bad. I hate this. I really do. I'm sick and tired of getting invisible characters. But, all in all, pretty good. Got a lot of duplicates. But, good duplicates like orcs. Cobalts. It's only duplicates. Oh, and this thing. Alright, thank you folks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.